Okay, hi there. Welcome to a video looking at the effects of changes in supply on the level of producer surplus. Now, producer surplus is the difference between the price that the supplier, the grower, the manufacturer is willing and able to supply a product for and the, the market price they actually get in the market. And producer surplus is shown by the area above the supply curve and below the market price. That assumes that the firm receives the same price for each unit sold. That's a simplifying assumption. So let's have a look at the effect of a shift in supply on producer surplus. Let's take the example of a farmer growing avocados or supplying avocados to a market. And the initial price is B and the quantity bought and sold is D. Let's assume, for example, that there's a change in supply conditions. Oh, sorry, by the way, initially the, the, the producer surplus is the area above the supply curve, below the price, the area is B, C, E. Now let's assume that uh, there's a bumper harvest or a fall in production cost, let's say, an increase in the productivity of, of um, uh, production, which shifts supply outwards and downwards from S1 to S2. Effectively, the costs of supply have gone down. Other things being the same, then the market price will fall, uh, fall from B to F, fall in the market price there in equilibrium. Uh, the new equilibrium is at point G, and so therefore the quantity demanded expands from D to H. We move down the demand curve from point C to G. So uh, an increase in supply causes the market price to go down uh, and the quantity bought and sold to go up. Now, what about the effect on the producer surplus? Well, the original producer surplus was area B, C, E. What do you reckon is the new producer surplus? Press the pause uh, button on the video if you want to have a quick go at this yourself. Which area shows the new producer surplus? Don't forget, it's the area above the supply curve and below the price. Well, the price has come down, but the producer has lower costs. So the new level of producer surplus is the area F. GI. And that's a bigger area. Although they're selling at a lower price than they did before, their costs are lower. The minimum supply price now is, for example, is I rather than E, and therefore producer surplus has gone up in this situation. An increase in supply will add to both consumer and producer surplus. Consumers are better off. Uh, their consumer surplus has gone up uh, from ABC to AGF, uh, and producer surplus is also higher. So in this situation, an increase in supply is uh, going to increase total welfare to AGI. And if both parties are better off, that's called a Pareto improvement in welfare. There we go. Impact of a change in supply on producer surplus. Thanks for joining this revision video.